So ladies and gentlemen, with the upcoming release of Call of Duty World War 2, I want to hit you guys up with a video talking about Call of Duty World War 2 Zombies, and specifically the first map called The Final Reach. So I'm going to be talking about in this video the perks that will feature in the first map in Call of Duty World War 2 Zombies, and I'm going to give you guys a description of what they do, and uh, that's going to be it. And also their kind of counterparts in Black Ops 3, so you know what they're doing, and when you get the game and you download Loaded, you'll be starting up your map the final reach and you're gonna know what perks to buy and what they do so ladies and gentlemen these perks do have German names and they are a little bit different to what we have seen in the previous Call of Duties they do perform around the same purpose but they are a little bit different and we do have some different perks around here so ladies and gentlemen, make sure you do smash the like button on this video, subscribe to my channel, and also go ahead and make sure you do chuck on that notification bell to stay up with all of my Call of Duty World War 2 videos coming in the future. So ladies and gentlemen, we're going to start off here with the first perk. We have 8 perks to go through. Let's start up here with the first one. The first one is Panzer Blitz, and basically what Panzer Blitz does is it's kind of acts like an armor to you. And when you actually go uh, close to death, basically, you actually get in injected, I guess, with more energy, and you'll be able to go faster and all that. I'm going to give you guys the actual description of this perk straight away here. Uh, the machine injects the user with energy, protecting their health in dire situations. It costs more jolt with each use, as death is inevitable. It doesn't really tell you exactly what it is it's not like juggernaut we got juggernaut later through the list basically what it does is it doesn't really do much while you're actually um like full health but when you do get low health it absolutely it just boosts boosts your energy up to the max i guess you'll be able to run faster maybe your health will get boosted but every time you use it it will require more jolts maybe you only need to use it like three times and like it'll only activate three times but it says, it'll cost more jolts with each use, with jolts do ca actually count as the points in this game. So it will count as more jolts each use, and because uh, death is inevitable, alright ladies and gentlemen. So that right there is our armor perk, aka Panzer Blitz. So that is our first perk on the list. Next up, we got Kugel Blitz right here, which Kugel Blitz is kind of going to kind of act like Double Tap from the Black Ops series. And with Kugel Blitz, your weapons have new life, increasing their damage output. So obviously it's going to be like double tap where one bullet does like two times damage than it usually would so that looks really op obviously we got the double tap we got the the good old double tap i don't know how much exactly it's going to cost but at least we know we do have kind of like a double tap in this game and it's going to be called kugel blitz i think that's how you pronounce it it's uh it's, it's really tricky pronounce pronunciations if i'm gonna be honest and the next two we got here are basically the same pronunciation it's it's, it's weird okay so the next one we have here is going to be snail blitz okay and snail blitz is going to be like quick reload speedy reload and basically what you're going to do with this is, it's basically as it says in the description there, speedy reload. Wish Schneider Blitz, <laughs> these names man, I, I'm, I'm terrible at pronunciation, I'm not sure if I'm saying it right. But with Schneider Blitz, your weapon feels like an extension of you, as if you've used it your whole life. Gain increased reload speed. So it's pretty self-explanatory. You're going to get faster reload speed. So yeah, Schneider Blitz right there is going to be basically like speedy reload. Now, okay, I, I'm not sure, this, this, we got Schneider Blitz right there, this is Child Blitz, okay, it's basically the same as Schneider Blitz, but it's Child Blitz, but they're totally different purposes, they're totally different perks, this one is basically like Electric Cherry, so Schneider Blitz will protect you when your gun cannot. A burst of damaging electricity comes forth when you reload. So it's basically the same of Electric Cherry. It's pretty, pretty uh, self-explanatory what it does, just like Electric Cherry. If you've used Electric Cherry, when you reload your gun, all the zombies around you will get electrocuted, and you'll most most times be saved from that. So that's really cool. I'm glad they've added that back in. Um, that could be useful. It depends if the map's really close in. Electric Cherry is going to be really useful, just like it was on Mob of the Dead. So now we have our Juggernaut right here. This is the health perk, and it's called Hild Blitz. So Hild Blitz gives you simply just doubled maximum health. So it's basically just acts the same as Juggernaut from the Black Ops series. You can go ahead and pop that, and you will have doubled maximum health. Pretty self-explanatory there. Next up, we have Force Blitz, which is going to be like a better punch, I guess. A better melee. So basically, when you use this, it makes every strike your best. 
best. Your melee damage is increased. I'm not sure exactly how much by, but it is increased. So this is going to be kind of like that perk from IW. I've got no idea the name. I know that it just increases your, 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 your hit, okay? So you can go ahead and just do that. So that's basically pretty self-explanatory. Again, your melee weapon, um, your melee damage is increased. So when you go ahead and use your melee, uh, it'll be increased. And the next one right here is going to be kind of like Quick Revive. So next up, we have Lebon Blitz. Lebon Blitz, while solo, Lebon Blitz automatically revives the user. But just like in the previous Call of Duties, um, it's only limited to three uses. While cooperating with others, Lebon Blitz increases how fast you revive allies. It works the same as Quick Revive in Black Ops 3. So yes, yeah, basically works the exact same as that. So that is Lebon Blitz right there. That is your quick revive. So next up for our last perk here, we have Lawfen Blitz. Lawfen Blitz is going to act as stamina up. And what Lawfen Blitz does is it ensures that your legs keep moving and never tire. Gain increased sprint speed and sprint indefinitely. So basically it's going to act exactly like stamina up. So you can go ahead and pop your Lawfen Blitz and you'll be set for running. You'll be popping your stamina up and it'll be a fun game. So, ladies and gentlemen, that is it for the perks, but what we do have next is the random blitz machine. So, this will give you a random perk. Basically, what I think blitz means, it basically means perk in German. I don't know, that's what I'm kind of taking it out as, but um, I'll, I'll probably try and get up at the end of the video what it means. But basically, Lawfen Blitz, um, what it does is, oh, random blitz machine, I should say. What it does is it gives you a random perk, so you can go ahead and basically act like the Wonder Fizz. Use it, and you can just go ahead and get a random perk right there. It says right here in the description, grants the user a random blitz. Basically, blitz, I think, means perk. Requires time to reset after you. So I guess you'll not be able to, like, spam it like you do in um, Black Ops 3. But you can just go ahead and just get it once. you got to wait a little while. So, yeah, that's basically how that works. But, ladies and gentlemen, that is all the perks in World War 2 Zombies and what they do. Hopefully, I helped you guys out. If I did, make sure you smash the like button and tell me in the comment section. But without further ado, I'll see you guys later. Peace out.